everyone welcome back to another video if you're new to my channel my name is miss tamika i upload videos once a week which is sunday and then i also throw in bonus videos throughout the week so with that being said you all i am here to share my favorite and my worst purchases of 2021 so if you're here to see all of that then y'all know what y'all need to do y'all need to click on my subscribe button y'all because it really 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 helps out my channel so with that being said we're gonna jump straight into this here best and worst of 2021 and it is luxury handbags because it's december and i feel like with all the unboxings that i have done hauls and things like so i just wanted to get on here and kind of share like kind of narrow it down to like my favorite that i really really had that i purchased start off with um i'm gonna just start off with the worst purchase of 2021 for me and it is I already know if you have been following me for a while but if you new to my channel I purchased my first and ever louis vuitton leather backpack one of my worst purchase ever of course it's mine i have to keep it and i do wear it but if i could have a choice in returning this to get something new i would have you would have to watch the video to understand because i'm not gonna really get into all of that you have to watch the video and i may leave it up in the cards or i may leave it down below but let me just say this to be my first and ever leather item for one i will never ever purchase a light color like this ever again the reason why i purchased this light item you all was because of the uh blush pink that's the only reason why like black interior would have been blush pink i would have gotten the black i wish i would have gotten the black because with that i wanted for my first leather bag i wanted to be a carefree bag like i didn't want to have to worry about anything i didn't want to have to baby this or anything like that it's all that happened i do have to baby this particular bag because i do watch what i wear with this bag and i watch what i carry what i took what i have in my hand I just really baby this bag and I didn't like I said I didn't want to have to worry about that because when I buy my bags I don't toss them around but I don't baby them so you know if it's one purchase that I regret is this hair purchase like I said I did handle the situation so you don't see it but moving forward I'm just like at this point kind of scared to wear the bag like I want to hey you all this is my worst purchase of 2021 but i love the backpack i just wish i would have gotten the black or the monogram now i did want the monogram at the time but the monogram was always sold out and see this is why i should have been patient and just waited because yeah you all this is not my this is one of my worst purchases for 2021 moving on to my rest of my items i didn't bring everything out but the things that i am loving so this here is Gucci and this here is one of my best purchases of 2021. I love the fact that it's crossbody. I love the way that it lays on my body. I do have videos for all these hair bags. I will try and insert each video in the cards according to which one I uh, talk about. If not, I'll try and leave a playlist down below. This one here I love so much and it's so crazy because like I stated in the unboxing, I did not like this bag whatsoever when I first tried it on at the King of pressure location because once i when i tried it on i was like mm -mm, i don't even want it. i gave it back so fast but i think once i was able to get the bag home and put my stuff in it it just i don't know i just fell in love with the bag yeah, and it's crazy because you know i didn't want it at first so yeah this here is one of my best purchases of 2021 well this here is one of my favorite purchases of 2021 and moving on to my next item this here you all this here now this is a bag a bag i thought i wouldn't love because of the fact the way it's shaped because i'm that type of person i like crossbody hobos backpacks and things like so I saw this here bag i was like hmm, let me step out of my comfort zone and purchase the bag if i don't like it i can always return it of course once i got her home i fell in love with her to the point that i did end up 
getting her hot stamp y'all when i tell you i love this hair bag and don't let the size fool you because this particular bag even though it looks small and petite it holds a lot you all when i tell you it holds a lot it's everything that i need for it to hold like it can hold my vlogging camera it can also hold my vlogging um uh, stick like the vlogging stick it holds my essentials it holds everything that i need struggling with the ysl bags and this bag actually holds more than some of those YS ysl bags i was here hauling hauling here on my channel but y'all i'm just telling you i love this particular bag and this is also a classic as well so another favorite purchase for 2021 you are i am super happy that i have this here in my collection I mentioned when i don't wear my bags i do store them in their dust bags and i also store a little bit of air paper inside of the bag just to let y'all know if y'all bags come with dust bags and air paper keep all that together just to keep the shape and the look of your bag just in case you ever want to sell and moving on to my next favorite purchase of course another gucci and let me just say this hair Gucci crossbody. What is this? Um, bum bag. I this hair bum bag because this is one of those bags that you can throw your essentials and go. Like you can throw your wallet, your keys, and your cell phone, and you good to go. And this is what I use this hair bag for. Really big. I think the uh, Louis Vuitton bum bag holds more. I was looking at that bag, you all, but I'm not sure as of yet. But I am looking at that bag. Just... A few things you probably could carry your vlogging camera in here but you probably won't be able to carry a whole lot more with this particular bag you have videos on all of these items where you can see what fits and how it looks on my body and I like that I like the fact that it's adjustable so you can adjust it like I said I just carry it like so and yeah so I love this hair bag so much when I purchased this bag this was under a thousand I'm not sure the price of this as of now I've been looking because once I purchase an item I don't normally go back to see but I'm not sure if it's on sale if it is I mean if it's still at the price that I purchased probably not but again I will check for you all you all I love this hair particular bag to my next few items is this hair wallet when i tell you i love this wallet a whole lot hair little petite wallet because the louis vuitton emily wallet i think that's the only wallet that i have far as uh louis vuitton gucci wallet but the louis vuitton emily wallet was like the long traditional wallet i do carry a lot of small size bags so i really didn't need a long wallet anymore i love my um new louis vuitton wallet for a few months but y'all when i tell you i love this hair wallet a whole lot i turn my card around um like i said you do have place for bills um you have some card slots here you have six card slots and then, and then you also have room in the back for cards as well coin pouch here like i said before i do carry coins in here this particular wallet i'm not looking to baby so far so good far as the inside of this here wallet i'm sure within time it's going to show somewhere so i'm not tripping about that but did say to watch out for the button now i do have a fuchsia button on my emily wallet and for me to have had that wallet for over I want to say over seven years the button still looks good so we go into this as much and when i do go into it i always grab it from here like i try not to touch the button too much like i open it from like the side just not to just to uh not touch the button as much I'm sure if that'll help or anything to keep the button in good shape so yeah you all this here is another favorite purchase of mine for 2021 now moving on to my next favorite item of course y'all not had to uh of course y'all not had to add the gucci uh small coin pouch y'all when i tell you this here is one of my favorite purchases of 2021 because of the fact that like i said this hair looks small but it holds a lot you can put lip glosses you can put um your keys like if you have a key with a key fob that can fit in here um you could put cash coins candy your face mask like this hair little thing holds a lot i haven't put um anything in here as of yet 
as you can see the um, keychain is still wrapped you can put a lot in here i love this little thing like this was the best purchase ever i was looking into purchasing the bigger size of the bigger size of this not sure as of yet because honestly you all, i really don't need it but yeah i just wanted to let y'all know i love this here item it's still available online because the last time i looked it said um you had to purchase in stores you all this here is another favorite of mine for 2021 and then last well not last but my next item of course my gucci cosmetic pouch i love this hair pouch like that is a different shape it's not what i'm used to but i love that it holds a lot you all like if it wasn't for the whole COVID thing, this thing would be full of lip products. Like all my high-end lip products, like my Time for fancy lip products. But again, COVID, I can't really do a lot with my lips when I'm out because I'm wearing a face mask. I just kind of like put like little things in here that I may need like hand sanitizer. And as you can see, this here is a bulky hand sanitizer, iron sheets, tissues, um, lip balms, and things like so in here but y'all this hair holds so so much so yeah you all this hair is another favorite of mine for 2021 well moving on to the last item of this hair video it is my louis vuitton graceful you all when i tell you this thing right here is my favorite of all time for 2021 i search high and low for this particular bag i purchased this way back when i probably wouldn't even gotten the leather bag to be honest for this to the point where i just wanted to get something so yeah you all finally ended up getting my holy grail bag you all i love this hair bag I wear this bag every day i plan to wear this for a while like a while the bag i started to switch out with the new bag so now of course i paused with purchasing bags so this here is the bag i have been carrying every single day well not every day but when i do go out you do have your red interior in the inside and when i tell you all i love this bag so much the next thing i plan to do is get this here hot stamp i just haven't gotten around to going to lennox mall i got an email stating that they have a mark jacob Jacob store inside of lennox mall so i do plan to eventually go down there just to um check uh the mark jacobs stores out i wasn't looking for anything particular at the mark jacobs store but i just wanted to check it out and see what's new because i do love mark jacob now i really do like i love me some mark jacob you all yeah, you all those were the items that i can sit here and say were my favorite purchases of 2021 and also my worst purchase of 2021 yeah you all just wanted to share that with y'all really fast and then also if you're looking to purchase christmas gifts of course you can take advantage of any of these items that i mentioned and don't forget if it's items that's hard to find remember check bloomingdale's neiman marcus nordstrom's and Saks uh to get those hard to find items well, i hope y'all enjoyed this here video so with that being said please give this video a big thumbs up because it really 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 helps out my channel and also before you go please don't forget to click on my subscribe button and my notification bell so y'all can what be notified each week your girl uploads videos and until next time and there will be a next time i will talk to you later bye